Welcome back, everyone. We're on our way to get more wood. That lumber mill is just churning it out. Um, yeah, money's back up again. So, yeah, there, there's our money maker. That's how we're going to fund this series. It's a little too easy, to be honest with you. So, let's go pick up the rest of those. Um, I guess we'll have to pick these up. The rest of the nine, nine footers, and then we're gonna switch the harvester. Uh, we might not do it during the episode, but uh, let's go. Let's get this loaded up. Uh, we'll switch to seven. That way we can get two stacks of seven. Uh, that'll fit in fifteen. So that should be, that should be good. Nine is not really, not really good. And Can we get more on there. Oh no, it's trying to do a second pile. That's not going to be good. Yeah, I think we're going to, uh, we're going to stop that. <laughs> I don't know how this is going to work out, guys. I mean, I wish I could stack like this, right? Uh, yeah. All right, let's cut through the woods here. That's not the way it's supposed to work. <laughs> How's everybody doing today? Uh, it's a good way to this way is a good way to go because there's no stumps It's a lot of trees to take down now, so I think we're going to do some off-camera work to Take down a lot of stuff. We'll do a little bit on camera, but I'm driving all over here. I don't care. Okay. Interesting. I mean, I guess if it works, it works, right? Okay, so let's go pick up the rest. Get it off the field. My bales are coming along. Cows are growing. I'm gonna buy some more cows. We'll buy, we'll buy a bit more. What I've been finding in doing series is that the animals always take such a long time to come to fruition. Sometimes beyond, you know, how long the series is supposed to last. So, uh, I don't have the attention span to keep doing 150 episode. Um, let's switch this. Let's pile one. Let's load this up. We'll see what we can do about getting all of these on there. Probably should have done the longer ones first. I'm sure it'll be fine. Yeah, I don't have it in me to do 150 episode series. Some people can do it, I don't. Uh, no, no thank you. I did log about... I think I did the math, or I had a look at the stats. Um, I did get about... 150 hours of game of playtime on No Man's Land. So that was uh, 75 episodes. There we go. I think I got them all. Um, that was 75 episodes, and uh, they were about an hour each. So between a little bit of off-camera work 
as well as editing, you know, cuts and stuff like that. It was like double, double the play time versus what I actually published. Well, it's kind of an interesting, interesting statistic, I guess, or not interesting. I don't know if you guys care about that, but. Just leave that there for now. Nothing else parks there, so we're not going to get in the way. Now I've got these these suckers to load up. Um, I guess I can super strength all these. Why not? I need a tractor, though. Oh, where are my tractors? There's one, there's one. This is done. All good. Now, I don't need this guy anywhere for the next little bit, so let's put, the, put him away. I have to buy some sheds. We have money now, so we can do stuff. But again, it comes down to the tractors, so I think what I'm going to try to do here is uh, finish up whatever we've got going. We're going to move on to August. And... Um, and then we'll see. Maybe we'll get lucky in the used. Oh, that's close. Um, in the used market, and see if we can find a, a good deal on a bigger tractor. Um, this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy. Okay. I think we're finished here. Yeah, it's such a wide swath that it picked up the next row. Okay. We're done. I'm calling it. Uh, let's put this away. It's just the light coming through. All right, let's get this uh, let's get this trailer loaded up. Set it on all the load. Uh, R. Now we'll get out. And we'll just throw these over. Oops. Okay. Let's turn off auto load. And then we'll grab these guys. We'll just manually put them on. The rest is all going to auto sell. So. I don't think that's a big. We won't won't be doing this again, kind of thing. Gotta love super strength, kinda. And we are going to. We're gonna head to the the market in the middle there. Okay, everything's strapped in. Don't sell these. And we'll have a rest. We're we're done. We're done for for today. 
Uh, why am I going this way? Uh, doesn't matter. Let's go this way. Oh boy, I'm almost out of fuel. That's a problem. I was not paying attention. I gotta make it there. I'll put in a. I'll, I'll buy a fuel pump. Look at my money just jumped up. Oh, please make it there. This might be a problem. Turn. Okay. An entrance here I can use. And I need to get up real close. That's 22,000 for that. And, oh, holy smoke, 60,000 for that. 551, wow. Okay, let's put up a, a gas station fuel pump thing. We'll do that real quick before I run out. Um, container. Uh, that's a trusty one. 16. That's a lot of, a lot of gas, though. Let's get a medium one. Yeah, where do I want to put this? Oh. Oops, I'm looking the wrong way. Let's put it right here. Why is it overlapping with something? We'll put it there for now. If we don't like it, we'll change it. Let's fill that up. All right, now we'll pull over here and fuel up. And we're safe. Oh, I have two R keys. There we go. Me. I don't know if that's a good place for it, but it'll do for now. All right, so let's move on to August. Oh no, I can't go move on to August. I cannot move on to August. Jeez. Um, I got a lot of fertilizing to do. I got to get the first application in. Oh. Uh, oh. Okay. I guess we're doing some more stuff, guys. So we'll do a little shopping, I think. I want to get the first application in before it terminates. Otherwise, I'll, I won't be able to get two, two in. Let's start with this field. Should go fairly quickly. And we're going to do, we'll just do a one headland. Okay, let's start. Okay. All right. So, um, what's next? What's next? This guy, I don't need to, I'm not ready for this yet, so let's head back. I'm going to go pick up males, bring them over, 
Now, I'm going to have problems because I think I actually have three sizes of bales out in the field. So, yeah. To do three trips, basically. I think I can sell the our log trailer now. And also that little trailer's kind of become obsolete. 26 will be very quick because these don't take much to load these up. There's very few of them. I think the two far ones are the ones that are different sizes. Let's try this one first, the far one. I'm not sure if that got put a different size or not. Okay. So I think that one is the same size, but it's not the same capacity. It's not the same amount, but it's the same 180. This will not, this is going to give me an error here. Yeah. Let's drag it over this way. This is how the professionals do it. Oh, and my dog needs to be let in. All right. Go lie down. Go nice bed. Right, let's get these unloaded. Don't need to get pretty because I think we're gonna feed them right away. We're uh, we're in a. I guess we're in a spot now where we really gotta start getting a lot of a lot of hay out. Okay. Okay, let's get this guy. We'll load this up as much as we can. I'll try to load the small bales first. Uh, let's get these ones. I can shove this one in. Nope. That's not going to work. I forget what the capacity of this is, but I think 
I think there's more than enough room to take a lot, a lot of product. A lot of product. A lot of, a lot of hay. A little worried about how much I'm going to have to produce here. Okay, one more small one and we'll start with the big ones and see what happens. It's not going to let me mix them, so... The thing is, is that I can, um, I can put as much as I want in there. There's nothing else that I have to deliver in there. The only real catch is that I will... Uh, I need to... Oh boy is that I'll need to uh, be able to get in there and deal with the manure when it's time. How much of this is it going to take? Could take a little while because they're big bales. Yeah, one gone. Let's have a look. Oh, there's still room for lots. Might be able to take the rest. Oh boy. Okay, that's all we got. That's it. That's all the food we got. While I'm here, why don't I grab a few of these? We'll dump that in front. Okay, that barley. We'll need to. Uh, we'll need to. Okay, so straw, 120 ish. This takes 475. And now we know. I hope that barley comes along soon. We're going to need to uh, get more straw at some point. Okay, that's it for that. The spraying fertilizer. Where is it? Where is it? There it is. That field's done. And then we gotta get this other one done. After that, I think we're good. I think it's just those two. I could be wrong though. Um, composition, rolling, lime. They all need lime. This this definitely needs it. This one's not too bad actually because this was from grass, right? So we got our first application, sort of. Sort of. Of course, dun 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 dun. dun. Okay, fertilizer going down. So it'll take a little while. It's not the fastest thing, but okay. So what's next? Um, 
Let's get a few more cows. 659. Holy smokes. Yeah, I don't know what I just did. Um, let's get... I guess we'll just keep buying the, the cheap ones. 430. That makes it... Uh, 490. Okay, I think that's going to be it. We're going to let them reproduce from here. Uh, these guys are going to be the ones that are reproducing. Uh, they're mature. Uh, these guys are probably reproducing as well, but there's only a few of these. So... Yeah, there's only like six of those, so I think we're going to let that go. Maybe, maybe we'll add more. We'll see. Um, all right. So next, let me check on this and see how it's going. Still 10,000 in here. No joke. All right. So what's on the agenda um we've got to i'm trying to organize myself here not quite sure where i'm going next so i'm gonna sell this stuff these two things but i can do that off camera that's gonna i think i might even be able to attach one to the other and drag them up there maybe maybe not or me, maybe I'll just reset. Or maybe I'll just sell them from here. How's that? How's that? Um, trailer. This. Let's get rid of it. It's only 7,000. I probably lost only a little bit by... This we don't need anymore. And also, let's do some shopping while we're waiting. Um, this trailer here. It kind of does the trick, but... I'm, I'm going to need bigger than this, so um, I need I need a bigger one, but I also need one that I can back up properly. So this is twenty eight thousand. So let's sell that, and then I hope there was nothing in it. Now that I think about it, um, any deals? What's this? This junk? Not junk, but I don't need it. So, let's see what we can get for a good deal. There's lots of options. I want to go case. What about this beast? 435. That's not really that powerful. 435. I kind of feel like we're heading into these categories. 402. And... These guys. 468 can go up to 558. This one can go to 692. I think that's kind of the thing we want, but 437, dun, 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 312. We need one. 435, 342. Sorry, I'm just throwing all kinds of numbers there. I think, I think we're going to do this. About time we bought a legit tractor. Um, wheel set up. Track, rear track, not crazy about that. Uh, narrow twin back. Twin wheels, rear twins. I think I prefer with just wheel weights. Yeah, so let's do that. Let's buy it. Let's treat ourselves to a bright, nice, shiny new tractor. There we go. Okay, and it is right there. So the progress has started. Um, we're we're going to start replacing the, the smaller tractors. 
And to go with this, I need the trailer. That's right. That's what I was doing. I want something big and I want something that I can, um, what do you call that? Green door. That's what I want. I don't know what that is. So this is a good one. That's 52. This one is also 52, but quite a bit more expensive. So I don't know why, why that is. I could get one for the truck as well, which we'll probably end up doing, but I want one for tractors. So I think I might go with this 52,000 liters. I'm going to need more trailers though. Um, I still have the forge harvester to buy. And with that, there's a special type of trailer I want to use with that. Okay, actually, what am I doing? I can buy unrealistic stuff. Ugh, oh, I'm an idiot. Um. Okay, well, here's what we're going to do. We're going to take this for a ride. I'm going to go load this up with stones. That's why I wanted to do this right away. And now that I think of it, I don't know how much stones that thing holds. Oh, no. Um, yeah, I don't know how much it holds. So what I'll do is I'll dump it on the ground and then I can use my loader. I keep forgetting that I have a bridge over here, so let's let's run over there. The stones I can buy in town, um, at the top, in the north. Oops, shouldn't drive across that, but. Looks like we've got some weather coming. A little bit of rain. Not sure what time, but it's okay. It doesn't matter. We're not harvesting anything. I believe I can buy right here. All right. What are we buying? There we go. Stones. I don't know how much these cost. All right. So, uh, 26, 26,000 is what it cost us. So it costs us about 500 per liter. Is that, is that right? That makes sense. Or am, am I mathing right? Yeah, I think so. I'll go load up the gold production, and then if there's if it can't take all this, I'll dump it on the ground. Let's cut through. be interesting to see once we start owning a lot of this land what my field layout's going to look like it gets to a point where the money doesn't matter as much anymore it's actually what you have to do to get <laughs> a field this big ready uh, I've got a couple of tricks up my sleeve though I think we're going to try to do stuff in, in like that batch buying of fields but the next thing I need to buy is a forage harvester um, with a header for corn to chop chop this field and then uh, then we'll be in business for producing silage which I gotta be honest with you um, I was looking at that as a key source of income for us but with the trees and that sawmill I'm wondering if I'm really 
wasting my time with it. But no, we'll play around. We'll we'll do we'll do a few different things. Okay, let's go get some stones into that production. All right, how much will this take? Oh, I think it'll take it all. Awesome. Yeah, absolutely. Not only that, but I could probably go get another load. Or two. Very good, very good. Um, I have lots of methane, I've got water. Okay. Sounds good, guys. Uh, where am I going to need this? I'll put this in the middle. Okay. Now we're just going to wait on this guy. Where is he? Yeah, two more passes and we're done. I'll be back with you guys in a minute. Um, I'm just going to get this done and we're, we're going to rest. So hang in there. All right, we're done. We're done. I could lime these fields. I uh, don't feel like doing it today. I'm not sure what the impact is of doing it after it germinates. Um, eh, we'll find out. We'll find out. I think ultimately when you lime, you want to cultivate it in afterwards, but I'm not sure. All right, let's have a rest. I'm just going to pull over here. Teleport over to the house and have a good rest the end the morning all right so clearly we haven't made any more money overnight so clearly that sawmill has gone through with all the wood already all right uh august weather looks okay cloudy nothing not too bad Okay, so what's our status now? Let's have a look at the fields. Uh, fertilizing, this will probably need it again. So we'll get that one done. Uh, these two should be fertilized, but realistically, I don't think I'm going to do that. And all of this needs lime, so we'll get that going. This is starting to get close. But we're going to need that forage harvester real soon. Real soon. So let's jump over. Where is it? Where is it? It's always the last one that... There it is. I'm going to have this run again through that field for, for fertilizing. Uh, I got to turn around. Tractor's getting really dirty. I should get that cleaned up. I don't want to waste any money on other, um, I got two repair shops now, don't I? I don't know if I mentioned to you guys, I bought, I bought this. I think I did this off camera, so I have another repair shop here. Now this whole field doesn't need it, but I'll do it anyway. In theory, in reality, if you put too much fertilizer, that can cause some problems. Cause your crops to burn. All right. Uh, actually, I don't even need to. I can just back up. Use the exact same course. Uh, where is it? Right there. Oops. Back up a little bit more. Okay. All right, so that one started. Then I'm going to get um, 
this guy. Let's go get our lime spreader. We'll, we'll do some liming. I know it's not ideal to do it afterwards, but still be it. Come on. This tractor might be a little underpowered for this, but that's okay. Check the used market in case we get really lucky and get a forage harvester for cheap. That's, you know, I think that's asking for a lot. I don't have any more wood cut, so our money is going to be stagnant for a little bit. Off camera, of course, I will do a ton, a ton of wood clearing. Now that I see how much money it brings in, um, yeah, there's going to be a considerable amount of, of uh, forestry done off camera. Um, I needed to do that field, didn't I? Okay, well, let's. Oops, I shouldn't be driving on this. Let's start with this this one over here. Sunflower field. Okay. Uh, course generator. Da -da -da, da -da. Doesn't show up on the ground, so let me just double check, make sure I'm not doing something stupid here. Um, there we go. Okay, so this isn't gonna work. So that's a stop. All right, I thought you could do this after, but obviously it's gonna be done before I plant. Let's go put this away. Next time. Next time we'll get it. I'm gonna get some sheds going here too. Okay, let's look at the used market and see what we got here. Any are we lucky? No, not really. Not really. <laughs> Forage harvester. What are we going to go with? I can't afford it right now, but we may as well shop for a minute. I could go... To me, it doesn't really matter that much. I don't want a small one, obviously. Um, ooh. This actually has its own storage. Ooh, this could be interesting. We are doing Unreal. No extra cost for that. Uh, interesting. They call that discharge speed. I don't know what that means. Does it have an internal capacity of 200,000 uh, 200, liters? Okay, and we're actually not that far off from being able to buy this. So we'll do this. Let's play around with the Colossus stuff. I need, so I need 300 plus I need this guy. So that is going to be another 53. So 360,000 basically I'll need to get this this thing put together. I'll be able to harvest this. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Anyways, it'll be fun. It'll be fun. 
How are we doing for time? We've still got some time to burn through here on this episode. I'm gonna figure out what I want to do now. Um, let's jump over to the gold production. So I've got two bars, two sets of bars. There's a few bucks right there. I do not own this lime. I don't really, don't really want it. No, it's a lime production. All right, I had a look around here. I've got um, 17,000 liters of manure and 44,000 liters of slurry. So that's pretty good. Uh, it's only this one that has the manure. Yeah, this one doesn't. And this one doesn't. Okay, so we only won uh, only one area that we need to get it from. So I'm going to need a conveyor system that carries it across here and out here so that I can load it. Um, the goal here is to get all of this into the BGA. So that's going to be a bit of a manual. There's no auto distribute for that. So we'll figure that out. Yeah, we'll figure that out. I did come up to um, with a scenario, I guess, on White Farm series where I was trying to figure out how to move manure using productions. Somebody suggested that there was a production that I could set up that would take manure's input, but also output it uh, as well. So I have to look for that. They, they, I think somebody um, mentioned the name, but I have to scroll back and, and look through some of the comments to find that. Um, shouldn't be too hard. I'll, I'll, I'll have a look. And um, we'll see if I can set that up. I can set up something over here where I can just move the manure into the production, have it auto-distribute over to the BGA. That would be absolutely fantastic. Same for the slurry. That would be ideal. That would be really cool. So, yeah, I'm not sure if that's going to happen, though. Okay. So this is moving along. I'm kind of almost at a standstill right now. Uh, I could do a little forestry. And uh, I think we'll do that. We'll jump onto that in a minute. Um, but otherwise, I think I'm going to be jumping ahead again to September real soon. So uh, forestry needs to be there for so that we can buy the, the forage harvester. So yeah, it looks like it's obvious what I need to do. Well, why don't we get going with some of that right now? There we go. All right, and my length is going to be seven. I mean, I could do, you know what? I could do like 15s, right? Would that be smart? I'm worried I'm going to end up with a whole bunch of those little tidbits that are a pain. Um, why don't we give it a go? We can't hurt to try, right? Alright. Typically, I like to set up in the middle of an area and then pull in stuff kind of a center so I think I'm gonna do that right here um, yeah let's start with this guy this is a smaller tree so I'm curious to see what's gonna happen with this let's see what 15 looks like see so it's gonna have a little, little ends but that's okay we'll, we'll figure it out we'll try it we'll see how it works bunch of little ends. I 
This is kind of my technique that I use for doing trees. Is I just kind of back up, line it up, do that. And I don't know if that's, you know, the way you're supposed to do it, but it works for me. Quick is really avoiding tree stumps. Although this thing will climb them. Sometimes I'll, I'll drag them quite a distance. Like I'm gonna grab all those ones over there. Let's bring them back. Prefer that over making a lot of little piles. Prefer to make bigger piles. The proper protocol would be to have a, uh, I, I don't know what it's called. It's like a log pusher to get them all into neat stacks and use a forwarder to load them up. I had a lot of fun on Corpy using the, uh, um, what do they call that? Oh, words. Um, the cable system to bring logs down from mountains and hills and stuff like that. For some reason, I really enjoyed doing that. <laughs> Not sure why. Get that guy tall, very tall. Timber probably going to run over a stump here. There we go. First person is kind of cool um, for doing certain things. A little bit, um, I don't know, I guess it's a bit of a pain sometimes. Oh. I got a little too close there. I don't know if that's a truck truckload yet or not. There's another camera angle where I can get, like, right in here. This one is making me nauseous. Let's take a break. We'll load these up. I don't know if that's quite a truck full, but we'll see. This is almost done. Where's my truck? We'll need one or more trucks. One more, or perhaps two more trucks, I should say. What are we set to? Uh, piles. That's going to be one pile, 15 meters.
Okay, what's a good angle to do this at? Can we just barrel in here? Okay, let's see how this goes. boy, what's up with that stick? Oh boy, we got a problem. Wow. That's interesting. Somehow wants to load in the front. Okay, there's a bit more there. We can probably load up some more. Let's do that. Those are some big logs. Oh, can we get that one on there too? Okay, is there anything left here? That was almost a perfect amount for this trailer. So we're gonna turn off auto load, turn on the straps. Let's go dump this. I'm curious to see what what's our capacity on this here. We got 24 tons. So it's kind of interesting. I think for some reason I feel like we had like 50 tons when we had the two stacks. Does that make sense? to slow down. Uh, I think if I park right here I should be okay. Okay, we got it all. So that's 52,000 liters. So it's about the same as the two stacks. For some reason the weight looks different. So, alright. Sounds good. Alright guys, that's going to be it for this one. Um, next episode... I think what we're going to do is move ahead to September, and I think this field is going to be ready. Um, boom, right there. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Um, but we're going to get our forage harvester done off camera. I am going to harvest a ton of these trees. I'll probably clear this whole area out here that we're working on. Perhaps all of this as well. Um, we'll see. We'll see about that. I've got some that I could go get here, and really, I don't have a lot more options. I mean, I could get this stuff here, but I don't really want to. Um, we could easily buy, you know, one of these, which is almost all three, um, if we need more. So, anywho, there's lots. There's no lack of trees on this on this southern part of the map. So. Hope you're enjoying this. If you are, please consider subscribing and I'll catch you guys in the next one. I hope you have a great day.